Another day, another book review. Hi everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing the book, A Court of Thorns and Roses, by Sarah J. Maas. Now, if you're a fan of Yar Fantasy, you've probably heard of this book. It's the first in a series and has gained a huge following over the years. So, let's jump into the review. The book follows Fire, a young woman who kills a fairy and is taken captive by Tamlin, a powerful fairy lord. As she spends time in his court, she begins to uncover secrets and discovers that there is a dangerous threat to the fairy world that only she can help stop. First of all, I have to say that I really enjoyed this book. The world building is fantastic, and the descriptions of the fairy world are vivid and enchanting. The characters are also well developed and complex, with Fire being a strong and relatable protagonist. One of the things I loved about this book was the romance. The slow burn relationship between Fire and Tamlin was beautifully written, and the tension between them kept me hooked throughout the book. The supporting characters were also a highlight, especially Rysand, who is both charming and mysterious. However, there were a few things that didn't work for me. The pacing was slow at times, and some parts of the book felt repetitive. Additionally, the ending felt rushed, and some important plot points were resolved too quickly. Overall, I would highly recommend A Court of Thorns and Roses to anyone who loves Yar fantasy. It's a captivating read with a great romance and interesting world building. While it's not without its flaws, it's definitely worth checking out. Thanks for watching my review of A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Maas. If you've read the book, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more book reviews and content.